It smells good though, but one hour, that's crazy. Yeah, that's how it is. So we are on our first trip guys, we're on our way to the Shea Butter Processing Centre and I mean you cannot come to the north and not get some Shea Butter, so I need to get myself some Shea Butter but there's no way I can get it without learning the process, that is like what they used to eat, to cook, to cream for hairs, lip balm, everything, Shea Butter is also one of the most healthiest so... <laughs> butter my whole life I can't believe it's actually happening so right now guys I'm with the lovely um, she's the owner of this place she's going to show us the process from beginning to end I'm excited so let's begin okay so in here is our warehouse Okay. So we're going to the warehouse. Oh my gosh, guys! We're going into the warehouse to see the storage of the of the sheer nut. So do you have like people who pick them from the trees or bring them to you? Yes, we have uh, collectors. We have share collectors, share collectors that we deal with. So they, theirs is to do the picking from the bush mm -hmm. and the parboil, dry and the husk. So they and then boil they it, it. They boil it. Yeah. And they, they dry. Boil. And, and they, they dry, dry it. And then they the husk. Wow. So look at this, guys. This is that shin up that green thing that I've probably shown you in another video. The the green is the fruit. It's the fruit. Eating. Yeah. Uh, it's eating. Sorry. After it's eating, then we this is what's inside. This is what is inside, and this is what is parboiled and then crushed. Oh, yeah. it already smells like shea butter, guys. I like so it. This, this is the shell. This is the shell. So you take this off? Off, yes. Okay. Yeah. And what do you do with this? We just throw it away? We burn. We burn it. Use it, yeah. use it for something we else. Burn it. We use the ash to extract some potash and use it for soup. Ah, yeah. nothing goes to waste. Yeah. Yes. Okay, so, so these in ones. This room will mm -hmm. do some sorting. You can see all these are coming from that bag. Okay. So you need to sort out the nets, the, the rubbish, the moldy nuts, the uh, bad nuts, black nuts, before you wash it and then you crush it. So, which one? So, something like, oops, like this would be crushed. Yes. We take off the shell, then we crush this. Yes, we wash it first. Yeah, yeah, like this. Then, then, uh, let me. <laughs> oh wow! So yeah. So oh my crush goodness! It like that. Yeah. And then this is what you take, guys. Yeah. Oh wow. Okay. Hey, that was easy. Yeah. Is there another one? I want to try. Okay, let's see if I could do it, guys. This is it. One, two, three. <laughs> oh, I did right, it. So you did it. Okay, good. Yeah. Oh. So with this, because it is a, a lot, they spread it and use a wooden mallet. Mallet to, to go. Do, pop, 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 pop. Yeah. I see. And then you will put this on this side. Yes. Good morning. So you put all the nuts in here. Oh my goodness, guys! After they crush it, this way they put all the crushed nuts in here. Yeah. And then you there. roast it on the thing. Yeah. Exactly. So that is what you put the fire. Yes. And returning it. Oh my gosh. Forty-five minutes. Mm -hmm. yeah. Is is this hot? Yes. Yeah, no, hot. no, it's not hot. Okay. That's why but we they have use, the handle. They have handles, and they'll use 
rack. Oh, yeah, yeah. So that means the ladies in a part, part, uh, well, a rack to hold it so that. It wow. So the ladies in the north are very strong. Okay. So now they're gonna start a fire for us. I think. So as you can see, the ladies over here are very, very strong. They don't only just ride motorbikes, guys. They carry wood, they carry heavy things. Now we just found out that the residue from when they finish boiling is used as what they use for their mud houses or the houses that they use for the local houses. I mean, nothing of the shea butter tree or plant or nut or fruit goes to waste. And I just found out it's actually the best charcoal that you can ever use. I mean, what is just amazing? Look at that. We don't need artificial things at all. Okay. Is after roasting it. After roasting it? Yeah, then you go to granite mill. Okay. You mill it. It turns out into chocolate form. Chocolate form, like yeah. a paste. Yeah, like a But can you use it like yeah, this? No, no, you can't use it because it is the residue combined with the shea. Okay. The, the butter. Itself. But you can't put it on your yeah, skin. Yeah, you, you can put it, but it will it will be brownish in color. Yeah. And but you can smell it and see. It smells like that. So let's see. Hmm. So you can't really use it on your skin yet. No, no, no. For now, no. So in the process, we'll you can't see use how it, yet it because is because it's still got the residue inside. Exactly, exactly. Now it's to that. It goes to that. Then it's ready to be mixed. Needed. Needed. So this is this one is gonna go on the fire yeah. before yeah. it comes this to be looking like needed. chocolate. Yeah. No, before it comes into oil, oil. And it boils to get the oil. Oh, yeah. so it, it's so chocolate, then it goes, goes to be to boiled the to the kneading. To the kneading. Before you get this after kneading. So where did the dark? How did it change to this color? When you are kneading, as soon as you continue to knead, it changes color. And where do you from take, chocolate color? Where did the residue come so from? Okay, let's go check it out. So some people use a machine and some do by hand. Yeah. So to make it easier for the ladies, maybe we should contribute and buy a machine for them. Yeah. But let's see how this goes. Okay. So this is the this is a lot of arm work, guys. Wow. And so how long will she have to do this until it changes colour? One hour? Yeah, she sit like this for one hour. Mm. Getting mm. up and then sitting one down. One hour yeah. just going in and, 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 water. and add water. Yeah. One hour. It smells good though, but one hour, that's crazy. Yeah, that's how it is. This is serious. So now we're about to see some finished butter. So after they've finished the kneading and they've boiled it, then it comes into this story. This is all your finished butter. So after this, after she's kneaded it, and we it boiling, we collect it, and uh, we get the oil. Yeah. And we filter it. So you after boiling, it. Mm -hmm. we will uh, cool it overnight. Filter and cool it overnight. So yeah. The next morning, it's. Uh, so the oil fried. is cold, yes. yeah, and then we start uh, stirring it to solidify it. Okay. If you don't stir, it gets lumpy. Oh, we don't want lumpy shea butter. Yeah. Okay. So, uh, and this is it. In this bucket, and stir them. Stir it occasionally to become solid. That's so much. So this is how we cut it. So this is like off and to sell. Yeah. 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 Whoa. Yeah. And so how much she sell one of these for? Three hundred dollars, but Ooh, it's heavy. Look at this, guys. Shea butter for the skin. I love it. That is why all the ladies in the north have such good skin. <laughs> Using natural shea butter. Oh wow, this is amazing. But it takes so long just to get to this process. It's not for the faint. Three days. So just to bet one of this can take about three days to finish the process. To finish the process from start to finish. And Look it is organic. This. No nothing is added. 
Oh, look at this. My skin's feeling amazing already. Natural from the tree. We've seen it from the nut. sad like I came ready prepared to you know do I've seen some videos so I was ready to you know put my hands in it put my energy in it but they said I can't because of my nails shout out to buy a sculpture for my nails though but still because of have I have my nails painted it's their food and it's probably gonna be sold and of course they don't want anything to chip off which I know it won't but I guess I have to respect their decision so <laughs> very smart because of course we're in the savannah area in the north it's dry so they collect water that's good okay off to the shop this is baobab this is neem mm. this baobab is, is a good fruit yes. This is uh, black soup. Mm -hmm. And then this is, this is shea butter, raw shea butter. Like the one I just put on my hands? Yes. And this one? It's yellow shea butter. It's What's the difference between raw. yellow shea butter and yeah, raw? Yeah, add some yellow coloring plants to it to dye it. Is it good for the skin or any? What's the difference? It's good for the skin as well. And these ones? Edible too. Edible? So this one I can eat? Yes, you can eat. And this one? You can eat. Oh, wow. Yeah. I can fry my food in it. Hmm, yes. I think I'm going to be doing that, you know. Mmm. It smells good. Mmm, very good. I like this. Ooh, maybe I'll buy this. Oh, oh. And guys, it's more of, um, this one is whipped. Can you see? Look at that. Whipped shea butter. Maybe I'll buy this one. Guys, imagine this. This is basically one kilo. 15 CDs. 15 CDs for all of this. This will last me for like a year. Got the soap as well. This is five CDs. And this one is what? Black soap. Black soap. Oof. Local, proper, proper local black soap. Yeah. So, if you're watching, I can't remember if you asked me for shea butter. Oh, I, I know there's one person, that's for her. I take one for me, and then one for luck, right? <laughs> <laughs> strong ladies me I can't do the things that you do and everybody around the world really really appreciate all of the work and the shea butter you do so from my heart I want to give you a small token to say thank you and to share it amongst all of you okay thank, thank you, you very much thank you very much thank you so guys, I'm here with the ladies in Tamalade, the ladies that put in all of their hard work and effort to make us our amazing shea butter. One, two, three, shea butter! Bye!